From being bullied to being brave. A six year old boy from Plainfield has walked that path this year, even speaking out against bullies. But now he faces another challenge requiring a different type of strength. CBS 2's Dana Kosloff explains in this original report. Take that, bully. Take that. It's been a year of perseverance for six year old Aiden, and now there's more for the soon to be first grader to overcome. I felt like he couldn't catch a break. We first introduced you to Aiden and his mom back in March when she was fighting to get Plainfield School District 202 to do more to stop her son from repeatedly being bullied at school. Other moms expressed concern too. It's just brushed under the rug and they're victim blaming. Months into her fight, but two weeks after our story, Nellie Sinus says school officials called to set up a safety plan. They just wanted to come, I guess, to peace and so that we could build some type of um, trust again. During all of that, they decided to turn a negative into a positive. You remember what we did with those toys? Bolstering a Facebook page called Aiden Fulfilling Your Birthday Wish. Happy birthday, William. Where he and his mom give presents to kids on their birthdays. I want them to feel happy. If they don't feel happy, I don't feel happy. We also incorporate uh, the anti bullying on there because um, it's something important for us. But now Aiden faces another fight. In June, he was diagnosed with a congenital heart defect and will have surgery next week. But they're ready to face this next challenge. And Aiden, a pretty typical <laughs> little boy. <laughs> says when it's all over, he just wants to keep laughing, playing, and giving other kids gifts. A staff at the school told me that um, Aiden was an unlucky boy, and I would have to say that he's far from unlucky because he's a kid with a great big heart. He's loving and generous. I Aiden will be in the intensive care unit at Lurie Children's Hospital for a week after his surgery and then out for at least another two weeks. But when that's all over, his mom says he's actually looking forward to going back to school rather than dreading it like he did much of last year, Erica. Oh, that laugh, that spirit, that giving spirit, we see so much of that and we need more of that in Aiden. I know, I know, that's so true. He just makes you smile. Yes, full recovery. We're, we're hoping, hoping right? Yeah, thank you, Dana.